Hello, everyone, and welcome to our session on modernizing your data center and accelerating your edge with Google Distributed Cloud. I'm Brad Bonnet, Senior Director of Product Management for Google Distributed Cloud. And with me today is my partner in crime, Rohan Grover. Hi, I'm Rohan Grover, Director of Outbound Product Management for Google Distributed Cloud, and I'm really happy to be here. Thanks, Rohan. Today, we are seeing a transformation that is happening across multiple industry verticals. We are seeing a lot of use cases in retail, with companies like Loblaw, the largest retailer in Canada, is joining a journey of digital transformation, evolving from a traditional retailer to a technology leader. Loblaw is looking to use distributed cloud features to add new capabilities like self-checkout and enhance the future of in-store customer experience. The telco vertical is another industry where we are seeing significant traction. Bell Canada is looking to drive operational efficiencies, increase network automation, and deliver richer customer experiences for their 5G network modernization initiative. Using the distributed cloud will enable them to provide increased speed and bandwidth capacity to the Bell 5G network and support applications that respond faster and handle greater volumes of data than previous generations of wireless technology. Another key use case is in the public sector where we see demand to use innovative technologies at the edge to increase worker public safety. Later in this session, Rohan will talk about Australia Post and how they are using GDC and our Vertex AI solutions to improve worker safety in their warehouses. The really challenging aspect of this transformation is that the expansion often leads to operational toil for the platform and IT operators and teams who build and operate across these sites. When we talk to IT admins, enterprises are increasingly concerned with security, governance, and managing at scale. Complexity increases across edges, sites, and clouds due to disparate control planes and generations of legacy applications, data, and infrastructure. As a result, many organizations' plans to modernize and transform have stalled or are not delivering the results needed for their business. Standardizing development, security, and operational tools enables enterprises to increase flexibility where it matters, modernizing infrastructure, applications, and data. To do so, however, requires operating platforms that can securely scale from on-premise to edge to the cloud while remaining open to change, choice, and customization. And that's why we built Google Distributed Cloud. GDC is the next evolution of our edge journey. With Anthos at its core, GDC is a cloud-centric platform that is, enables enterprises to run modern applications anywhere consistently at scale. We offer a wide spectrum of solutions from managed software on your own hardware to fully managed hardware and software services to a completely air gap sovereign offering. GDC enables customers to standardize development, security, and operational tools to build and modernize application infrastructure and using VMs, containers, and Kubernetes in their data centers, at their edge locations, and in the cloud so they can run more applications in more places. It uses Anthos to deploy Google's leading cloud-centric Kubernetes platform, GKE, and adds enhanced management, security, and compliance monitoring features. Flexible by design, Google Distributed Cloud brings Google technologies to where you need it most. Based on an open source foundation and a vibrant partner ecosystem, Google Distributed Cloud gives customers the flexibility of solutions, operations, and form factors to meet their unique needs. It has built-in intelligence. We bring leading cloud services like Vertex, AI, and ML to where the data is being generated and consumed so customers can harness real-time insights across deployments. It's secure by default. You can scale with confidence using the best of Google security across edges, devices, and our planet-scale network from the simplest to the most sensitive workloads. And last but not least, it gives you consistency at scale. It uses 
Anthos, our cloud-backed control plane to provide a common experience for developers and IT admins across any environment. So GDC can run in and help you ban manage your environment in any way you choose. We have a variety of different offerings to match the needs of your business. And it starts out with our GDC Edge, which gives you a fully managed solution of hardware and software in one connected environment. We also have GDC Virtual, which is our software-only based solution that allows you to bring your own hardware and manage it from our connected control plane. Last but not least, we have our hosted uh, option. With GDC Hosted, we give air-gapped hardware and software that can be managed by Google or a trusted partner for the most sensitive workloads in the world. So our journey so far has been an evolution. It started with Anthos launch in April of 2019, and we've continued to double down and innovate on this platform. And continuing on that strong momentum, today we're very excited to announce the general availability of our GDC Edge GPU optimized configuration for your AI and ML graphics intensive workloads. Many of our customers from retail, manufacturing, and automotive sectors are already testing this new GPU optimized SKU to deploy visual inspection and worker safety applications in their facilities. With the GDC Edge GPU optimized config, you now get the horsepower of 12 NVIDIA T4s that can ha together handle up to 300 camera feeds at the same time. This opens up a whole new window and segment of on-prem applications that need to return results with low latency and high accuracy. And so with the GEA GDCE GPU config, we're very excited about how customers are gonna innovate with this new capability. And now, I'm going to hand it off to Rohan to talk about the GDC services. Thank you, Brad. It is so exciting to hear about all of these innovations, and I'm going to talk to you about how one of these customers is using this innovation in a few minutes. But with that, I do want to talk about our portfolio of Google Distributed Cloud services. One of the core value propositions of Google Distributed Cloud is our commitment to provide a variety of services both for Google technologies as well as our open source and third party partner ecosystem. With our commitment to open source, we believe that we can innovate faster and allow customers to deliver their business outcomes. For our public sector customers, using our open source foundation also provides some guarantees of portability as well as meets their sovereign and compliance requirements. Now, if I talk about Google technologies, I'm super excited to mention that our industry-leading AI ML capabilities are now available on Google Distributed Cloud. We announced this back in June, and this includes our Vertex AI ML set of solutions. One of the key services under that portfolio is Translate API. This allows us to translate text in hundreds of languages almost instantly and opens up a whole host of use cases in industries from uh, finance to manufacturing and public sector. Another key AI technology that we are opening up on the Google distributed cloud portfolio is Vision ML. And I'm going to talk a lot about how Vision ML, ML en enables one of our customers as we move forward. In addition, we're also allowing customers to use our database services on Google Distributed Cloud. One of the key use cases for data on the edge is sovereign requirements. A lot of countries, a lot of industries, including finance, have requirements to have data locally. And because we've enabled our new Omni database service in Google Distributed Cloud, they can now use either our Postgres SQL database or an Oracle database to do just that. Our services journey is evolving, and over time, we will continue adding additional Google technologies as well as open source and third-party services to the portfolio. So to recap, Google Distributed Cloud has offers designed for greater choice and customization based on your unique needs. Let's talk about a few of the customers that are adopting these solutions. GDC Edge and Virtual, which is our connected portfolio, they're being used in multiple industries. Some customers in the telco field that are doing this include AT&T, 
Bell Canada, Telenor, as well as Reliance Geo. We have customers from other verticals, uh, including financials like HSBC, who are again utilizing the capability of our platform to provide unique value to their customers. And last but not least, we have the media and entertainment type of customers like Major League Baseball and uh, Telegraph, uh, who are also using this to provide cutting edge experiences for their customers. On the other end of the spectrum, we have Google Distributed Cloud Hosted, which provides air-gapped hardware and software solutions to meet the most stringent of sovereign requirements. We have partnerships with the likes of T-Systems in Germany, as well as Thales in France, so that we can work with the public sector agencies in these countries and really meet all of their compliance requirements. We are super excited with the traction that our Google Distributed Cloud portfolio is seeing across the board, across multiple verticals and multiple countries. And I now want to talk about one specific use case that is using one of these technologies. So Australia Post, as we talked about, is an extremely large Australian public sector organization. It is a postal, mail, and logistics company that employs 35,000 uh, workers across the country, and it delivers mails and parcels to millions of their customers across Australia. Um, this company has multiple distribution centers or warehouses that are spread across Australia, which they use to store all of these millions of packages. And one of the key concerns that their execs had was around worker safety. As you can imagine, a warehouse is a fairly chaotic place and lots of things can happen. And the reality is 90% of safety incidents happen as a result of human behavior. So our goal was to minimize the amount of safety risk exposures. And the way we did that is we used one of our innovative AI technologies called Vision ML, which is part of our Vertex AI suite. And we put that on our Anthos-based Google Distributed Cloud solution. This solution aggregates feeds from all of the cameras in these warehouses and then essentially pinpoints worker safety issues. One key worker safety issue is, as you can see on the slide, there's a forklift that's going dangerously close to an employee. Now that could result in injury or even death. And our AI is able to pinpoint those issues and essentially teach the workers and teach the staff at these sites to avoid some of these issues. Our objective was to provide a 50% reduction in safety risk exposures. What we achieved in our first pilot site deployment over nine months is an 83% reduction in employee risk exposure. It's a phenomenal result. And as a result of that, Australia Post asked us to do this in production in 29 major sites. And with that, we achieved a mind-blowing 98% reduction in safety risk exposures. As you can see, this technology is already helping organizations around the world. You can see multiple examples of this. There are verticals like manufacturing, where you can imagine this technology being used for the same use cases. You could also see this being used in retail stores. Um, let's say there's a spillage, and the AI technology can help identify the spillage and prevent a customer or an employee from causing injury to themselves. So with that, uh, I do want to hand it back to Brad to take us home and summarize the session. Thank you, Rohan, for walking us through how our GDC services and application ecosystem have evolved over time, as well as that deep dive into Australia post. What a fantastic outcome. So today we started off by talking about how we're seeing the world evolve and drive needs for use cases outside of traditional cloud and how Google Distributed Cloud is best suited to meet those needs. We talked about our portfolio of solutions with GDC Edge and Virtual for connected use cases and with GDC Hosted for our disconnected sovereign use cases. Finally, we talked about our services and application ecosystem and how Australia Post is using one of these services to solve a real world problem. I wanted to thank my awesome co-presenter, Rohan, for being with me today, as well as all of you at home for watching this presentation. I hope you have a great rest of your day, and thank you. <laughs>